Hey y'all, it's Ashley, Carolina Trailer Sales, carolinatrailersales.com. We are located in Pine Hall, North Carolina. We are by appointment only, and you can best reach me at 828-773-4500. So super excited about this trailer. This is a 2024 8312 Stampede Murhow. Murhow's done some changes. Um, to their construction or manufacturing of their trailers. Basically, um, they have made them better. They didn't need to make them better, but they made them better. So, two things, they made a stronger, taller top piece and a lower piece. And basically what those things are, are the top rail at the top of the trailer and the lower rail, rail at the lower of the trailer. And, and those two pieces are for stability, for strength. Um, they made them of stronger gauged aluminum. I don't have all those specifics. I'm not that technical. Y'all should know that by now. Um, so anyway, just, just the bottom line is the trailer didn't need to be any better, but we made it better. So I'm going to leave it at that. With that being said, it has made the trailer now almost 7, 8 tall. It was 7, 6 before. Now almost 7, 8 tall. So like that for headroom for sleeping in the bed area and then headroom for horses in the horse area. So two, two good things right there for, for both, both parties. So the other cool and neat fact is pewter. The color pewter we had before is no longer. Silver mist, which is the color here on this 8312, is the new color. So silver is the new pewter. I love it. If you don't already know, everything I own is silver. All right couple other cool things that I'm going to point out. We have a new graphic on the nose, which I really like. We're going back to vintage, going back where it came from. So we've got some running horses in the M above the Murhow, above the Stampede logo on the stainless nose. So that is a difference. Um, you can kind of see that top rail, how much taller and how much I guess thicker that looks. I mean, I don't know if you study our trailers, but it's definitely a difference on the top and the bottom rails there. You can really see it here in the nose. Um, way stronger. Keyword. So now I'm going to get into this trailer. So this is a 2024 8312 silver stampede. We've got two dual jacks, hydraulic. Lockable battery box, spare, two propane tanks, and a jiffy jack that all is standard. The two jacks are not standard, by the way. I just put two jacks on any eight wide that's over 12 feet. Got the new graphics package on here as well. Got three drop down windows with bars, two manger doors with manger storage. We've got load light package, load lights all the way around. Those are LED lights on each side and on the rear, and they all have switches. We've got a new flip up, so let me kind of focus in on this. This is different from before. Before we just had a sucker, rubber sucker that stuck into the other one. Now we've got a little bit of a shock. Some of your other brands have these. We now have one with a shock. It makes it for easy push up and down. I know if I go somewhere and I pull down my step, it's so loud. So uh, the days of that are gone. Back to this trailer. This trailer has a sandy wash, which is a super nice um, option that you can clean out your black tank. So pointing that out. All right, spinning on around. We've got aluminum wheels. Rear tack, collapsible. We've got a blanket bar, bridle hooks, saddle rack that is uh, collapsible and does come out. A couple other things. Um, the They've redesigned this rear collapsible tack. Kind of redesigned this back end of this trailer. It's got a rubber bumper inset kind of there. Of course, I'd have to go to an old trailer and kind of look, but... These are subtle things, but actually uh, big changes. So big changes on our dividers. Check out the lock. The latch is different. Remember we have the pull latch before with the, um, the kind of springs. You don't have that anymore. It's a whole lot simpler. So different pull latches here. 
Go back to, there's still airflow all the way, front and back airflow dividers, padded dividers, a lower divider in this trailer. Um, we're gonna jump back in, and again, everything is nice rounded edges still. Um, gotta get a little WD-40 for that. Fully lined and insulated, roof vents, all the things. Empty weight of this trailer, 10,409, 10,409. Spinning on around. So I'm going to try to show you these dividers again. It's not the easiest for me to show you. Um, airflow completely through. But these are new dividers and these are new latches. So changes, big changes. All right, spinning back around. Try not to make this video so long, but I had some key points to point out that were important. It's not as easy to see the color on this side. Power awning, inside outside speakers, LED lights on the outside, grab bar lights up, porch lights. This does have a 10 gallon hot water heater upgraded to that. Pretty confident that this has an upgraded uh, air conditioned unit, the 15,000 BTU. I typically do that as well. All right, stepping in. This color is Connect Maple. We only have two color color palettes for the Stampedes. This is the darker, which is called Connect Maple. You guys have seen this layout many, many times. I say it all the time. It's my favorite. Well, this trailer would be going to my house if I didn't do what I did for a living. I love the silver, love the interior. This is by far the best layout, in my opinion, for the size. You get big closet, Steps up to the bed that are kind of in the middle, so you're not on the one side of the steps on the bed. Closet here, coat closet here uh, with hanging bars on each side. Um, here for extra storage, storage here under the TV. Bed area is good and spacious. It has the hookup for a TV in the corner there. Too much to say in this video. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm away from my norm. This does have a ducted AC propane furnace. The fridge is off the floor on the slide box, which gives you a huge floor space in this trailer. You got dogs, big dogs. They need dog beds. They need to be out of your foot room to go back and forth to the bathroom. This would be a great layout. Flip up counter added there, glass top Two burner stove. This has the convection microwave. You've got storage there underneath the kitchen area. Two double stainless sinks, soft touch walls. If y'all watch my videos, you you know enough of the things about the Murr house. They're all pretty consistent. Storage underneath that couch, all the way across the deck. I'm going to try to step back, give you kind of a full visual of this uh, main main cabin of the LQ. That does have that flip behind that pillow. Um, here, I'll just show you. It's got that flip down drink holder. Nice thing about these stampedes is the crown molding. Well, or the chair rail that they put throughout just kind of finishes it off. All right, bathroom in a 12 foot with a walk-in closet. Like I said, this this is my winner. This is my this is my layout. This would be the perfect trailer, perfect size. Um, walk through door to the back. Sink and vanity here. Pocket door to the bathroom and corner dome shower. It's not a dome. It's round. Um. Opening that up for you. Skylight above. So to recap, this would be a new redesign. Murhow 8312 Stampede. Connect Maple being the color. Silver Mist being the outside color. All I can say is well, super nice trailer. One more thing that they've done that I super like, it's kind of like a signature. They've engraved 
and that's engraved in the wood merhal there on the control panel so let me kind of come back so it's just really nice it's engraved there just looks nice it's just a finished off piece kind of like the stampede finished off piece here in the um, top of the slide box so 8312 2024 heading back out I'm trying to go back around one more time so you guys can see that that silver color matches my building just looks so pretty right here love that added horses all right all right guys carolina trailer sales carolinatrailersales.com we appreciate your subscription we appreciate you watching our videos this is ashley you guys have a great day